Hey my pretties, thanks so much for clicking. I really hope that y'all are going to enjoy this makeup look that I recorded for you. I don't know, I just wanted to do something very sexy, very sultry, a pop of color but not too much color, dramatic but just kind of simple, all over the place. That describes me. Well, basically what I did was I did a look of self. Hope that y'all enjoyed this video. If so, give it a thumbs up and share it. Share it with everyone that you can share it with. Share it in every group you can share it in. And also subscribe to my channel so you can see more of me. Let's get right into it. Hey pretties, we're going to start off with the Morphe 35W palette and I'm going to use this warm brown as my transition color. And I'm using Morphe brushes. I'm not going to list them right in the audio, but they will be down in the description box, the brushes that I used. Now I'm just taking a fatter brush and I really want this look to be transitioned very, very well, so I just wanted to go over it. I'm gonna take this beautiful shimmery um, iridescent color and I'm gonna put that right under my brow highlight. I don't usually do a brow highlight, but in this video it worked out perfectly. I'm now going to take a black color and I want to really create some depth and definition the big part about this eye look that I think everyone really, really liked is that I created a lot of definition with my eye. So it definitely depends on your eye shape, learn your eye shape and learn how you need to define it. Now I'm gonna take this Morphe Gold Eyeshadow. I'll have the name down below as well. And I'm just going to pat that one on the free lid space that we have left. It reminds me of like a yellow B, I don't know, like golden yellow. I've never used this kind of eyeshadow color before, so this is fun. Now I'm using the Shawing liner. You know it's my favorite one. I still haven't tried that NYC liner. I know I'm so behind, but right now I really, really love the Shawing liner. Um, I know I do my liner a little different. I start in the inner corners first, and then I go out and I draw my wing. I did a really dramatic cat eye wing because I really wanted to squint my eyes out a little bit more. I think that adds to the sultry too. I'm not doing my face, so I'm going right into lips. I'm sorry if you want to see a face tutorial, I'll link one where I'm doing my face makeup as well because it's pretty much the same exact routine. Right now I'm lining my lips with a liner from ColourPop and then I'm using Limbo by ColourPop to just darken it because the liner, I was not liking it when I was using it. It was just too light for what I was trying to do. So now I'm using this as my first lip color and also as my lip liner. It's Limbo by ColourPop again. Then I'm gonna go in with Anastasia Beverly Hills, the color Ashton. And I'm gonna put that in the center of my lips. I'm not showing on camera, but I did do this about three to four times to create a lot of intensity and depth in that center. And that is pretty much it. Very simple eyes, I told y'all, and very simple lip. And this is your final look. I really, really hope that you enjoy it. Again, there should be a video for my foundation routine where you can see that it's pretty much the same one. I don't wanna get repetitive. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up. And I'll see you on the next tutorial. Until then, stay pretty.